Well, they're wishing for water, but the feds say there is none to go around. Good evening. I'm Jackie Parks. And I'm Todd Carley. Today, farmers in the Central Valley are dealing with yet another blow. The U.S. Bureau of Reclamation announced that no water from federal water projects will be allotted to Central Valley farmers for irrigation. The feds operate a vast system of rivers, canals, and reservoirs that span across the state. 23ABC's John Genovese has more on what the announcement means for the county's agricultural industry. We're in a position now that, you know, we don't know if we're going to be able to make it through next year. It's a worry only water can solve. I've been doing this a long time. Um, I Personally, I've been farming for 40 years. I know I've never seen anything like this. Citrus grower John Gless is doing all he can to hydrate his 7,000 acres. We're uh, in the process of drilling wells. Hopefully those wells will be done in time to you know, to kick in and, and, and help us. Help he's no longer getting from the feds. It's scary. Today, the Bureau of Reclamation announced that no water from federal systems will be allotted to Central Valley farmers. The announcement comes after another from the state that for the first time in 54 years, California water projects aren't releasing a single drop either. Half a million acres in the Central Valley alone might go out of production. That's the size of San Diego and Los Angeles combined. Benjamin McFarlane with the County Farm Bureau says consumers can expect food prices to rise. There's no magic wand to the situation. The only magic wand is more rain. But we need federal legislation now to prevent uh, things from getting worse. McFarlane says farmers must now depend on wells and water from the Kern River to nourish their crops. These are just starting to, they're starting to push right now. John says his yearly water cost used to be around $600 an acre. Lately, though, it's been six times that much. We can hopefully purchase enough water to keep us going, you know, paying ridiculous prices for it. Prices that he says will only get worse. John Genovese, 23 ABC.